What is going on, you beautiful people? It is Charlie here. We are back with another ranked duel video. This time, we're going the chalk, man. I wanted to go full damage chalk so bad. He's been buffed like a ton. And Maman Brigitte is open, and obviously that's pretty scary. Like, the ability to just dash inside of me every time I want to ult is going to be annoying. But I'm maxing the two because the two has been buffed so much that at this point, maxing the two is actually preferable. And I want to see how crazy it goes. I really honestly do. Like, sure. Sure, the one's nifty. But the two is just just cooler by, by that account. Um, I got to remember not to ult when she has her dash up. Like, I obviously, she could dash away. But I mean, like, she can just go inside, wait, come out. And it's just so annoying, so... Some things to watch out for if you guys haven't played Maman recently. She's got a lot of outplay potential doing things like that. Like if you're Nuwa and you drop your minions and she can just go inside you have immune the explosion and leave. Is this man starting Divine Ruin? You have zero MP5. There's no way in hell you do anything other than a blue buff here. Like it's actually not possible. I didn't think so. Alright. So we are going... I'm thinking here. I'm thinking how these match this matchup's gonna go. I imagine if this clears. Yeah, it does. Okay. And I'll probably one one more time because the cooldown's lower. You didn't do a buff. There's no way she already cleared it. Okay. Yeah, that's not to say. That's fine. Okay. Okay. See this? We're going for a wraparound play. Found ya. You see how I got... What's it called? I, uh... Can we clear that? Insane. I feel like I can just not ever die to her, but... I want to get those minions, man. Dang it. I'm gonna take a bit before I actually feel confident fighting her. Her MP5 sucks, remember that? Oh, she still hits that. That's whack. That is whack. I mean, she does start with 60 power. Like, it's not as if that's a weak start. I just assumed she would have run out of mana, but she's not. Not in the slightest. We're getting there. Oh my god. She has ult. She has ult. I'm terrified. She's gone. She didn't do it. What the fuck? What is happening? I'm so confused. I don't even hear her on her blue. Yeah, she didn't even do her blue. What is this? Okay, dash, so obviously I'm just gonna take this. Run if you can. Wait, what the f What do you mean she got it? She got that what? I'm so confused, man. I don't like this matchup at all. I feel like I'm just getting styled on. We're still maxing Torrent, all right? No one can stop me. I'll be stealing all of the movies. It's a shit joke, but hey, I said it. We're getting there. We're getting there. Soon we will be an unstoppable force. My God. I am baffled that I am down in gold currently. I am baffled about it. My man started divine. And said, I am going to be winning this game and there's nothing you can do to stop me. And like so far, I believe him. On God. I old he went a mana chalice you know what would help instead of a mana chalice just an item with mp5 at the start man <laughs> all right let's do a bit of a damage check let's see how this goes couldn't hit her unfortunate wait dash into me yes that's good that's perfect why'd you do that Yeah, let's cook. 
I don't know what she was thinking. I'm going to be honest. I don't know what she was thinking, but it wasn't something good. People get like surprised at how little damage the axe does. And then when they see Tor, they're like, oh, that's where the damage is. Okay, gotcha. Understood. Won't happen again. Like, it absolutely chunked. 223. And we're only getting better. Um, you know what? I do think we go Genji's over something like Pestilence. Obviously, every Mamon and their mother is going to be going Lifesteal. But I think cooldown is going to be much more important here. We can always just get a Brawlers. Like, that's not the end of the world. Pestilence is just so much better. But I don't want to build Jotuns. Jotuns is like... Just not an item I need right now. We're already full clearing. That goes so hard. She got her soul spikes. Could you tell? I don't think you thought about this one. Darn it. Still want to kill her. I think I can still. My two chunks. Does a lot of damage, but I can't get close to her. There is no escape. I'm not going to dash in. That's just dumb. But I will fight her. Go inside. Do it. You're lucky. What you doing? There is no what you doing? Okay, she went for her own shit. I was like, well, what's going on here? I gotta watch and just see. I will say maxing torrent is definitely like less satisfying than the chunk of Thunderstrike, but like that's pretty cool, right? Like what I just did? Just clearing the way with your two and fucking off. I'm very sorry about this. Alright, you win this round. I'm not sorry about anything. Alright, we go. We go. It's probably Hydra's here. I feel no pain. I feel no pain. I believe you, bro. Look how bloody I am. One of the coolest things about this skin. If you're on a kill streak, you get more and more bloody. I only have one, but like I want more. I feel like I can just point these. Nope. Need the one to actually hit the doink him. I figured my two would be able to enough, but I guess the Genji doesn't help and Hydra doesn't help that much either. But hit. I thought I had that. I didn't. It was not. As good of a play as I thought. You think I'm done with you, though? That's what I want to know. Do you honestly think? No kind of hurt. Run. Run. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna for okay, I was going to say I'm going to force her dash and then just axe her, probably. Couldn't do it. I knew that ult wasn't going to hit. I wanted to just force her dash with it, but... She got out of my range, unfortunately. I don't think my ult gets much value here, so I'm just going to max my one of my two. Like, it's nice. And if I, like, slow them hardcore with my rain dance... I don't even dance. If I was, like, getting it, that'd be one thing. And we have dance technology. Shiva fucking dances. So, all I'm saying, make chalk dance. But... I just think it's going to be used for forcing her out or threatening CC and stuff like that. Definitely just want Blink, I think. I imagine Aegis would be quite useful late game because I've seen how much damage this character does, but he's going defense now, so think about the next time he's going to get percent pen. It's going to be after a, a breastplate and then a full item, which is likely just going to be Titans. I mean, Typhons. Where you at? 
ringing the dinner bell. My mom. I'm just going to sit here. Maybe she'll walk up. She did. Cool. I walk in darkness. There is no strong. Run. Eh. The Aegis was nice. I was thinking like, can I still kill her? And then I was watching those Phoenix shots add up. But I'm like, doesn't really seem like it. We will take a red buff though. Those are free. I'm just dashing over. There is no escape. Run. Run. I definitely expected her to be here. She was not. Has she not done Chester? Chester has not spawned because she hasn't done him. What the fuck? What is happening? You think I was on fire? There is no escape. I guess she did. Oh. I should have fucking played that better. I'm such a stinky noob, man. Should have played that better. So, whatever, I'll just get the minis. That's all I can say. He went cursed onk. Interesting. Not bad. Definitely, like... Gets value. Still interesting though. I'm definitely just going for full serrated. I don't really want to back because I don't think she's gonna walk up too much. No Run. Run if you can. We got our serrated. We'll get out, get some wards, head towards fire. We do it pretty quickly with this build. And I play I talk about this every time I play Chalk, but just in case you haven't seen, there is an auto attack reset in Rain Dance where you auto proc the three and auto. It doesn't actually go off. You can't see it, but the damage is there. I'll show you. I'll show you. It helps for things like fire. There is no <laughs> what I wanted. Waste of time. All right. How quickly can we do this guy, huh? There is no so it's auto three, boom. And during that cast, this one is going off. Hello. Ooh, that was bad. Right there. You guys just blowing from stupid town? You just blowing from stupid town? <laughs> Very nice, Trellster. Classic. And then once again, auto bonk. See, the 64 shows up despite your auto not being able to go off. It's still kind of nice to know. I believe I couldn't get this with the dual orb. What are we doing? Alright. We'll take that. Get on out of here. Full damage chalk. Oh, damn, it's Chuck. I love Chuck. I hate my life. Okay, hmm. who wins this? Surprisingly closer than you would have guessed. This is how we get it. Surprisingly close than you would have guessed, but remember the gold, I have 2,000 in pocket and I am about 2,000 up. So we are essentially even there and she used relics and I didn't. So something to consider. Wasn't actually that close. That was with no gold lead. That was with no gold lead and uh, are using relics. But that's something people don't consider a lot. Like in the SPL, we always talk about... Um, like, oh, this gold lead's massive, but it's right after a fire giant fight, and there's three people with 3k gold in their inventory and not spent, which means that that gold is actually 10,000 less if you've got three people with 3k. 9,000, but you know what I'm saying? Run if you can. All right, it's probably Brawlers here. As much as I want to just go like Dominance Heartseeker, which would be funny. You know what? I'm going to do it. <laughs> I'm just going to go Dominance Heartseeker. It sounds more fun to me. I'm getting more autos off anyways. We'll get wards in case we have to do fire again. Once it gets to the next like little pizza slice, 
pie slice, whatever you want to call it. That's when it's the best to do it. Right now, you don't have that much time, but... You know. I'm gonna double ward. Uh, I'm just gonna do fire, actually. She has to defend these waves for a while. I don't think she had time to put a ward down, either. Seems like she's heading towards it, but I don't think she gets here in time. Yeah, she definitely doesn't. Autos are absolutely chunking, though. Damn, I wanted to block that. I think I can catch her, though. Yep. Smart. Can't get her. Unfortunate. Just do a little free poke. We obviously have... Okay. Unfortunate. Unfortunate, really. Oh, last game. You gotta be hitting those. Unfortunate. One, like, I don't think it would have mattered too much, but it definitely would have made things closer if, uh, what's the call? If she goes inside there, because it can be very annoying. You stall for cooldowns. If you come out with like a nice stun, like locked and loaded or something like that, you know, that can always be interesting. But man, the skill floor for Maman is very high, but the ceiling is even higher. There is just like so much room for outplay with that character. I just uploaded a Joust video with her. Extremely fun, but my God, is she frustrating to face. I, I, I think I'll be banning her in the foreseeable future in most duels. But in this case, Chalk is just a huge bully. Heartseeker would have been the last item, but you can also go like heavy XC or something if you just want to absolutely slap ass with your auto attacks. Uh, this dude never got pen. Like Typhons would have been preferred. Like this build, you know, not enough pen for me. But I do hope, if nothing else, that you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, you already know what to do. Leave a like, drop a comment, subscribe, all that stuff helps me out a ton. It's been Trelly, guys. Peace.